What's up guys, Admiral Styles here. Red alert, so in this video, we're gonna see if the Olympic class can go after an Excalibur class. So of course, it being a medical ship, I'm going to double the shields. And let's open fire. They already opened fire. Okay, the shields took that hit. So we need to go after those quantum torpedo turrets. Wow, they have way more than I thought they did. Okay, let me zoom out a little bit. I don't know if you guys noticed that, but one of the quantum torpedoes in Excalibur fire was deflected back to the Excalibur. That must be a unique feature of this uh, ship. Let's see if it happens again. There you go, it bounced off. Interesting. Maybe that's how I beat those two Megvars with the uh, torpedoes just bouncing back towards the target. Ooh, that was close. Wow, the Excalibur is much bigger than I thought compared to the ship. They still have regular torpedo launchers, yeah? Maybe not. That is so cool. I never saw any ship in Bush Commander do that. They literally bounce back the torpedo strikes. I've never even seen anything in the uh, script files or anything that would indicate the ability to bounce back torpedoes. Okay, with most, most of their torpedoes disabled, they seem to be trying to keep us away from their weak shields, but that's not gonna last long. Their hull is severely damaged, okay, Excalibur destroyed. So we're gonna try that again, but from the reverse. It's gonna be Excalibur versus Olympic. We got him. Yes, sir. I'm curious to see if I can defend against that uh, deflection power, whatever you want to call it. Red alert, shields up. Wow, it seems like all of the torpedoes just deflect off the hull. Yep. Okay, so we cannot use torpedoes, only phasers. Let's target their sensors. Or perhaps their shield generator is the better target. I doubt they can deflect from the hull. There you go, that's how you had it done. Beautiful. So after the shields collapse, they just melt. Makes sense. It's a hospital ship. It shouldn't have crazy armor, but the shields should probably be the best in the fleet. Alright, so that was interesting. Let me see if I can beat it to the Excalibur with an Excelsior class. Okay, this is the Federation Starship Al Batani. This was the ship that uh, Captain Janeway was a first officer of, I believe. First officer or science officer. Ooh. Our four shields became useless after just one strike from uh, Excalibur. Oof. Tractor beam has been disabled. Yeah, I don't see us winning. 
Force shield is draining. We have a hull breach. Force fields in place and holding. Bad stuff. All right, let me try the war one more time. I feel like I can probably pull something off. I like how there's plasma the coming out of thin air. <laughs> All right, let's try that again. Red alert, shields up. Let's double the forward and bottom shields and dorsal as well. Right off the bat, let's target their sensors and fire. is draining. Nah, it's no way to win. Not with an Excelsior class. Alright guys, that'll be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to the like, subscribe, all that good stuff. I'm Admiral Styles, and I will see you guys on the next one. Peace.